Welcome back to our channel, She Said. He Said. I'm Rasha. And I'm Jay. Thanks for joining us once again. Jay, please tell them what the channel's all about. On our channel, we talk about relationship topics and we give our views and opinions from a woman and a man's perspective. So if this is your first time, please consider subscribing. And if you guys are returning, we thank you for your support. Yes, thank you as always. So today is day five of the 30 for 30 challenge. I got five on it. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get right into the topic. This comes from one of our loyal friends. Uh, the topic is. Because you didn't say who was friend. Because you have that info. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> oh yeah. So uh, this comes from off of. Uh, Y'all reached us out on Instagram, Tony Ann, and. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to butcher your last name because there's like two other last names. That I don't want to butcher it. But Tony Ann from uh, Instagram said that, uh, or they asked, "How do we choose our vacation destinations?" Yes. No. So it's a great question. Thank you for the topic. Yes, because y'all know we love talking about vacation <laughs> and going on vacation <laughs> and looking at vacation stuff. And, and living life like we're on vacation, right? Yes. Day-to-day <laughs> -day life on vacation. Exactly. So how do we choose our vacation destinations? Um, well, y'all know that we like to frequent Destin, uh, Florida every single year. Mm -hmm. um, we've been going there for... Four years. I think four years now. Um, and out of those four years, a couple of those years, this might be the second year that we've actually went twice in the same year. Mm -hmm. I think we did it in 2020, maybe? Yes, 2020. I think we went in 2020, we went twice. And then this year, we're going twice. So you guys know that we already went earlier in mm -hmm. June. And now we're about to go back in what, how many days is it? What's the date? The fifth? That's what it's the fifth. Like the 11 days. 11 days. Mm -hmm. So we're going back to Destin. Uh, that one, I don't know. I'm trying to remember, but it seems like for Destin, we just kind of, we had heard about it. Mm -hmm. right? right? Well, we saw, you know, we watched, um, what is it, like Beachfront Bargain Hunters and yes. all that type of stuff on HGTV, you know, like four or five years ago. And then we would always see this, this magical place called, called Destin. <laughs> Yeah. And I was like, we got to check that out. Where is that at? And and actually, unbeknownst to me, when I was younger, when my mom took me to Panama City Beach, I'm talking about when I was probably like 11, we drove, you know, into Destin. But I don't, really don't remember, you know. So, uh, but apparently I had gone at 11 years old. Yeah. <laughs> but, but uh, yeah, so, I mean, we just were like, we need to go there. We need to see this place uh, from watching, like I said, the Beachfront Bargain Hunters and Beach Hunters and all that on HGTV. And so we just end up going uh, the initial time we went it was like uh, what, uh, Christmas time. Yeah, right after uh, Christmas. Yeah, right after Christmas. Because uh, we were there for New Year's, basically. Yeah, it was 2018. And it was like, you know, it was one of those dreary seasons. Happened to be those few days in there where they get it where, you know, it was a little dreary, foggy. So we didn't really get to see it at its full you know beauty at full potential so the next time we went we were like okay we're gonna go at a different time of year and the next time we went i'm trying to remember when was that because <laughs> we've gone so many times now i don't remember but um but yeah and it was warmer and it was just like yeah this is how this water should look this is how so i mean we enjoyed it either way yeah but uh it was nice to actually see it at its glory quote unquote so yeah so now we frequent there every year um, and if you've been following us for a while, you know that we were actually talking about moving there um, what, last year, right? Yes. Yeah. So, you know, change of plans. And we're still here in Houston, um, but we still frequent there because we just we just love the area. We so, do. Yeah. yeah, I forgot about that. We found out a lot of these places we found by just watching HGTV mm -hmm. um, and just always seeing like the Caribbean life, Hawaiian life. Beach hunters, or what is it? House yeah, hunters, uh, bargain beach hunters. Yeah, just hunters all the stuff is beach, beach, beach. Yeah, that's like, us. So that's that us. that's part of the way how we actually do <laughs> plan our vacations somewhere where it has a beautiful beach, right? So that's us. Um, exactly. And then, uh, you know, we are actually going to. Did we tell them about going to New York at the end of the year, right? No. I mean, it seemed like this was moving. <laughs> all in the fall. Yeah. Um, yeah, so, you no, know. No, tell them about New York. Yeah, so New York, we, we you know, because they've been trying to get me back to the cold. You know, I grew up up north and uh, love the cold. 
you know, for many, 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 many years. And then I got to a point where my body is like, no, no miss. Like, go sit down, go somewhere warmer. And so I finally agreed, okay, I'll go back to New York, freezing cold. <laughs> so I'm like, it didn't take much for her to agree. <laughs> All I've been hearing about for years, and when I say years, I mean years, year after year, is talking about New York. I miss New York. I, I haven't do. been to New York. You haven't taken me back to New York. <laughs> he didn't. Uh, uh, he didn't. On and on and on. And then I say, okay, let's go to New York. Then, oh, you're trying to get me in the cold. Yeah, because I wanted you, to go in the summer. Like, you, you know, I have be, some great New York summer memories. You're not even going to be thinking about cold because you're going to be like, I'm back in New York. So, you know. Yeah, so um, New York definitely, uh, we do actually, you know, want to go uh, someplace that we've never been. Like, uh, Salt, was it not Salt Lake City, but right outside of Salt Lake City, Park City, Utah. Uh, we've talked about going to Denver, uh, Boulder area as well. Well, New York, I haven't been to. Well, I was saying we, because I've been. Oh, we, because <laughs> me, Cheyenne, Faith, uh, we haven't been to New York. Mm -hmm. um, and so, you know, so we're, ex we're excited about that because mm -hmm. we're actually going... Uh, during Christmas time, mm -hmm. so we're going before Christmas, stay there through Christmas, and then afterwards, and then we'll come back, be back here before New Year's. But pretty lengthy stay, so we've already got everything planned. We're staying in Brooklyn. Brooklyn. So where Brooklyn at? I don't care what she says about the cold. <laughs> you know, she's excited to go. Yes, I, so. I, I miss my. Uh, I don't know what number home I would classify that is because I, I do have quite a few of them. But um, yeah, high high on the list. Yeah. Um, but I mean, other places like, for instance, when we went to the DR, once again, you know, yeah, I, I knew that Dominican Republic was a country, but um, we hadn't actually, you know, I hadn't actually seen scenes of it, pictures of it until we watched uh, Caribbean Life. And right. I think inter maybe it was even International uh, Living episode as well um, on HGTV. And so it was like, I've got to get to that place. And that was really like eight years ago when I just was like, we were seeing the episodes, plenty of episodes of it on Caribbean Life. And I was like, I have to get to that place. So um, finally, you know, we made it a dream come true. Of course, this year, as you know, um, there's many other places that we plan to and we And I fell in love with DR. <laughs> yeah, so. he fell in love with <laughs> I was trying to go back this summer, but the flights was just too much right now. Yeah, so. but we're definitely that's that's actually a trip now that we said annually we will start to go on. As yeah, well, we're so. well. As at, you at guys minimum. know, we actually went there. It really was for business purposes because we were going to look at a property that we were looking about investing in. Um, you know, that was going to be built. So that's really why we went. But of course, obviously, we went and had fun as well. And so that's still uh, a top priority on the list. Yeah. So. Um, but yeah, just, I guess the way that we find these things is we just, you know, we've, I don't, obviously we've watched a lot of HGTV <laughs> and just watched like every episode on beach stuff <laughs> and just giving us ideas. Cause they'll have things on there and you'd be like, Oh, I never thought about that beach or, you know, whatever it might be, <laughs> you know? And so that's one way that we do it. And then other than that, we kind of just do our own research of stuff. Or maybe you just hear from somebody or maybe you see somebody else's, you know, YouTube video or Instagram or something. And it's like, man, where where is that at? You know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then we'll just research it and be like, man, that looks nice. Or, you know, you know, we y'all know that we like to watch Hallmark, too. <laughs> exactly. Well, a lot of um, Hallmark is filmed in Vancouver, we, Canada. And that's a place that I'm going to go. We're going to go because I'm. Right. Um, uh, well, that's another thing it's just like you know we i don't necessarily just choose it by looking at other people or situations like that it's things where i'm like you know where where would i want to go um you know that i've that i've never gone before what is a spot in the world that i want to go to so um you know definitely uh vancouver uh toronto as well panama like actually panama Panama, the country, yeah. uh, that's been a, a one on my list for the longest time, and we were actually yeah. trying to figure out, you know, when we could do that one. Those are on the radar for <laughs> next year. We're already Jamaica, like, come okay. On. <laughs> it's like, yes, going back to the DR, definitely. Mm -hmm. We always go to Destin every year, but Panama City, Panama, the country is actually that's. I mean, just looking, it was like, yeah, yes. you know, and then of course, been, I've been trying to get to Jamaica for a while, Jamaica so it's Mom. like, we're looking about going there and going to Montego Bay, yes. um, and with, with the list goes on, because Rasha showed me some stuff in the British Virgin Islands. Uh, uh, has anybody gone? Like, if yes. you've gone, please let us know, like, how is it, what did you think? Because I'm telling you, the place, we, we use the Bonvoy Marriott app uh, to, you know, help us plan for, you know, hotels and whatnot. 
and the place that they have the resort they have there oh, oh my gosh like just looking at it we're like when can we move yeah, I, was gonna say, yeah I, go, I might purposefully miss my flight. Be like, I already got it. Hey, yeah, you know, I got something to do. You know, because man, it's yeah, just. But yeah, the, the list goes on. I mean, if you really think about stuff like that, you know. And then so I'm, many I'm planning places. how I can get to Europe. But that's another thing we kind of have, you know, started back flying more frequently. And initially, it's been what places can we get to in a two to three hour time? Because I, I got to get my, you know, flight wings back up. Not you know big on flying when I was it's, it's funny because when you're younger you don't even think about stuff twice like I, I flew a lot you know when I was younger uh, between you know childhood age and, and into you know young adult and then it was years that I didn't like at least 10 years I did not fly and then in those 10 years I'm like oh you know fly you know <laughs> so now I gotta get my you know my flight wings back well, it's gonna be a little bit of a uh, you know for us I mean it's like three and a half hours going to New going York going to yeah. And then it's like over four hours coming, coming back. back. I'm guess, hoping that it can shorten that. I guess the wind direction is, you know, yeah. something or whatever. Exactly. But. So, but that's pretty much how we pick. And then and the, the cool part about it, I would say that, I, you know, we're very fortunate, very blessed that we actually kind of agree on a lot of places. You know, it's never really been pulling teeth with one another, even with our kids. Like, they're pretty much, you know, and that's what... I'm like, I, we've mentioned this recently, and I was like, I'm, I love the fact that our whole family is a beach family. That's one. And then even outside of beach destinations, you know, a lot of times, like Canada, the kids are like, oh, yeah, let's go, you know? <laughs> so it's it's wonderful that we kind of actually, for the most part, agree. There's been a few places here and there where he might say something, I'm like, mm, you know? <laughs> but, but for the most part, we agree. Yeah, yeah. We got to get some... Uh, I like that cold destination like you said like Denver or somewhere Park City Utah or something yes. and get some some skiing on the beginner slopes you know yes yes uh, well, yeah on that. the baby the baby 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 slopes yeah the baby 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 baby, 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 baby. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going to wrap this up, but thank you for the topic once yes, again. Yes, appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, once again, day five of the 30 for 30. We will see you tomorrow. Yep. Make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe, share the video. Yes. And as always, believe in love, believe in yourselves, and believe in each other. And we'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.